a sad day indeed because when you're closing the ice cream shops that means the weather is getting colder it's closer to winter no one wants to hear about that they want to keep the ice cream going but in the meantime first alert meteorologist Kristen Emery is here to at least tell us that there's going to be at least a warm-up coming toward the weekend that's good news we have ice cream weather for the next seven days you know it's always ice cream weather for us but true uh, definitely for the next seven days it's going to be uh, above normal we hit temperatures that were close to normal today and now a nice warm up is actually really taking hold starting tomorrow. Right now it's a little cool out there. You're thinking, well, boy, we have lows in the 30 tonight. It's not very warm. It's going to be a big contrast between the frosty mornings the next two days and then highs near 70. So we're at 44 in Pittsburgh, 38 in Washington, 39 in Latrobe, Indiana's down to 36. Look at the almanac for today. We hit 61 for the high, very close to normal, which is 63. We were at 39 degrees this morning, not far off our normal low of 43. So a very seasonable October day and tomorrow more of the same. We start off in those mid 30s and then we'll inch up there into the 50s very quickly by noon, almost up to 60 and then topping out just a couple of degrees warmer than normal in the mid to upper 60s. Freeze warning for the Laurel Highlands, the ridges, areas along I-80 and then down to the south, Pittsburgh, Beaver, Washington, Green counties under a frost advisory. So tonight, tomorrow night, two of the coldest nights so far this season. Latest drought monitor. This is updated every Thursday, so a quick peek shows we are still in very dry conditions. In fact, we have uh, severe to moderately dry conditions all across southwestern Pennsylvania. It's not going to get better anytime soon, though, because although we have a lot of sunshine and beautiful weather on the way, we don't have much of a chance of rain at all until next Wednesday. So a very dry forecast. The temperatures tonight under clear skies with light winds are really going to drop on down to 32 in Catanning, Indiana, Butler, Pittsburgh, waking up to 36 tomorrow. 32 in Washington, 33 if you're waking up in Greensburg. Grab the jacket tomorrow morning or the fleece. And then later tomorrow afternoon, the sunglasses, short sleeves, temperatures in the 60s. Pittsburgh's high 67, beautiful sunshine again. Light winds, frosty again for Friday night football. And then Saturday morning, lower to mid 30s, a little warmer. And then as we head toward the afternoon, lots of sunshine, a warm airflow again pushes us up close to 70 degrees. So forecast for tonight, 36. Patchy frost here and there. Tomorrow, sunshine, beautiful, 67. Very, very nice weather, light winds. And then here comes even warmer weather. For Saturday, 71 and sunshine. It'll be chilly in the morning, upper 30s. By Sunday, we're up to a high of 72. So beautiful weather all weekend. If you're raking leaves, if you want to check out the fall foliage, it'll be great. Very mild for the Steelers game Sunday night. Kickoff temperature still in the mid to upper 60s. Next chance of rain not until next Wednesday.